Hi, I'm Neutralite scientist Dr. Kristen Morris. And I'm particularly passionate about gut health and its relationship to our overall health and wellness. You know, it seems like everybody is talking about gut health, but what is a healthy gut? I usually tell people that a healthy gut is a gut that goes unnoticed. A healthy gut is a gut that's not rumbling with gas while you're sitting in an important meeting. A healthy gut is a gut that isn't running too fast, making you leave the meeting with urgency and afraid you won't make it to the restroom in time. But a healthy gut, it's also not running too slowly. You have normal bowel movements. And of those bowel movements, a healthy gut has stool that is easily and naturally evacuated. Not too hard, not too soft. But perhaps most importantly, a healthy gut teaches our immune system how to behave. Our gut teaches our immune system how to differentiate between friendly bacteria and bacteria that could potentially make us unwell. There is a community living within us. One such community is found within our gut. We call this community our gut microbiome. Trillions and trillions of tiny living organisms, primarily bacteria, living, breathing, feeding, and growing within us every minute of every day. Our overall health and wellness is impacted by how well we maintain a healthy gut microbiome. Is that your gut microbiota is subject to change for better or for worse. And there are steps you can take, things you can do each day to help balance, maintain, and restore microbiome balance. Some examples include consuming a colorful, vibrant, plant-based diet that's rich in fiber and other nutrients like phytonutrients. Adding fermented foods and beverages to your diet because they contain good bacteria that can also contribute to a healthy gut. And a very easy thing to do is to use a probiotic dietary supplement. Probiotics are good bacteria that work along with other good bacteria found naturally in your gut and daily use helps to continually replenish levels of good bacteria in the gut.